I have no idea what to do. I, I haven't really been playing anything. You know, first or last. Bro, that's kind of the mentality I have. I'm, yo, I'm... I'm glad I got second, but like I'm pissed I got second. Give me one second. I want to get the the stick, bro. You got this bad boy right here. It looks sick. Ain't that bad boy on the wall? I was gonna, I I I'm gonna put it in like my trophy case, but I gotta get like a stand for the stick because I don't want it like flat. Oh, you know, me and Big Bear were talking about this. I'm gonna be on the the blast from the past now. Next year, when they do EVO again, that's going to be me up there. Just watching myself lose all the time. For the entire rest of EVO. <laughs> Eternally salty. Between these two juggernauts, we got Dalsum, of course. Crimson said it's always going to be Sim for me in this top eight. Idom said, look, Laura, this character I'm going to go, be going with, I feel, he feels, that some players didn't do as well as they could have this weekend because they didn't believe in their character choices. He said he believes in Laura. Woo, that's a knockdown. But here's the interesting part about that mechanic. Like, it's not even it's fun to joke about. It. I'm joining Big Bird. Yeah, I'm joining Big Bird. Clearly, one of the best characters in this game. In fact, maybe top three, maybe even top two. Yeah. You know, most people do say he's the strongest, but Balsam is right there. I must win Eva Jafet. You know, and this is another thing. It's funny because we were just watching over the. This is why you'd rather be lucky than good. This was an accident. Really been... I definitely didn't mean to do heavy kick there. I meant to do command grab, but I messed up. But you rather be lucky than good sometimes. I I used up all my luck versus Crimson. Oh no, it was supposed to be a little bit of 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 a little bit no one knows about that buff. So many people got hit by that. So when you do... I, I forgot exactly what patch she got this, but when you do level 2 clap like that, she's plus 2 now. So everyone always like challenged, and everyone got hit. And yeah, he just got hit. Strong and holding onto the right spot, but oh, just no. like this, we talked about how people were uh, Gotchka was jumping in on Daigo. Same idea, oh. jumping in on Crimson, so tough, but Idom's done it yet again. Oh my god, no AI I feeling. With the crouching heavy punch, you might be dead because Laura just does so much damage. Dalsum doesn't have a lot of health. He does go for the reset, and now the single hit confirmed into the elbow. Nice costume tech, just like that. In you know, I, I didn't get to use my costume all of EVO. I was gonna com I was gonna complain, can you get my costume on the EVO stage setup? But I was like, nah, let me not do that. Okay, V reversal, yeah. You can see the kind of pressure the kind of pressure that I uh, that Mr. Crimson's feeling using those V reversals. Oh no! Who put me in loser is Reinhardt, the prodigal son. Oh, I don't know what he did here. I don't know if he messed up or like it was just some secret Dalsum tech that I never seen before. I don't know what this was. What is he looking for? Is he trying to do here? And then I didn't even know. I wasn't even expecting that. Yeah, I don't think he, uh. He tried to end me. Bro, he tried to hit me with some shit because I don't know what that was. 5D setup. So, one thing before. Yeah, and I have actually never beaten Daigo up to this point. One thing that I will say that I am lucky to be, I guess. I did, before I did play Daigo, I definitely messaged Punk, like, some, like, I messaged Punk and Do, like, advice to how to fight Daigo and Guile, and they actually gave me some really good advice on how to go about fighting Daigo, so, I am lucky I had that. Obviously, Daigo without that many resources, spent it on the critical art in the previous round. Don't let him tell you that players in their 40s can't react to us. Don't let him that mechanic. Stage, <laughs> Look at that dude, Daigo, reacting with sweep. Said, Play a real game, like Street well Fighter But I couldn't react well when I was young, <laughs> yeah. so it's fine. 
I go, he had potential control, maybe he wanted oh, here to just safeguard himself. Here's Idom. Is this another Idom comeback? Oh my god, he's still going. He gets Here's the Idom. hit. Yeah, fuck. If that overhead hit, he was probably dead? Nah, probably not. He probably had one more guess. But that was a good flash kick, because I definitely couldn't have got like a combo. No. Die I against Daigo, I wasn't even thinking about playing poison. I was watching Daigo versus Fudo a lot, and I just saw Fudo kept getting smoked. I wasn't even thinking about playing poison versus Daigo. This matchup was purely all lore. I already I already knew I was committed to lore. But you know, he's the one who's there, and like I said, he said that he's confident in Laura. Yeah, you you mentioned that he said you have to believe in your character, and that's what he's doing right now. But Daigo is just putting up a wall. And here comes ah the reactions yet. Yeah. Daigo said you cannot sneak a thunderclap on me. Got the anti air. Goes for the low option. Nice using the. Bro, Daigo block oh, everything, bro. Laura's standing heavy kick is a dulcim limb. Defense. Oh, what what a tech. Still pestering. Idom's got the knockdown. EX! Dai goes out of it. He gets a punish. Now, like I said, his oh, offense! Shit. His offense! This is where he needs to run it! All right. So he goes for the full combo here. Knockdown, flash kick. Okay. Mix up the mini! He went for, like, some super optimal combo. Because I think he tried to do stand strong, stand strong, crouch medium punch. And he messed up. But I kind of, like, I was like, oh, shit, he dropped. And then teched immediately. And then I just got hit. The offense that you've been talking about. Here we go! It's not enough! Oh, oh he blocked it! No punish, but still has an opportunity. Look at all those resources on Idom's side. He can't, gotta be- He jumped! Refreshing. Here he goes! He needs one more still! Oh, watch out. Oh, he did it. Why didn't he just react to the command grab? So, one of the things- one of the things Punk told me was I go super yeah. stubborn and I caught on to this maybe like two or three rounds ago. Every time I did Crouch Fierce, he threw a sonic boom. And literally I just held on to that and I was like, yo, he's just gonna keep doing this. That's how I always got this jump in. That happened like twelve times and I was like, yo, he's just gonna keep doing this. So, oh no, that's a jump in right there from Idom. Command throw! What's the pressure here? Goes for the meaty plus frames again. I go blocking, patient. However, he's being pushed into the corner. The confirm will come here from Idom. He's got the corner. Next is stun. Okay, nice activation from Daigo there. Guarantee. Well, no, never mind. Here we go. I love that offensive. Not enough. Yeah. That was that was me being bad. Again, those offensive fear reversals. I love this decision by Idom. All to try to keep Daigo in the corner. Oh, no. Why did that not work? Laura's V shift is so bad. Why did that not work, bro? That was a good V shift. It Laura's V shift sucks. Poison would have hit him, but Laura's V shift is so bad. <laughs> now the beep too no. far away. Okay, Diego finding a lot of them. However, yes, again. Here he goes in for offense. If only he could build more, but what? hard to do. What? Here's oh. Idom! He's got super! Yeah, watch out! He could potentially go- Oh! The shimmy! Guess what, everybody? He was sleeping, he knows that's plus, so he was scared to do anything. Nice V-break to push him away. But again, those offensive V-reversals! He's there! Idom's gonna need one more! Daigo's life is on the line! And he throws it over! You know what's crazy? Getting hit by this- I was like, oh shit, I'm gonna get put like on a Daigo highlight reel, because I was like, this is how this shit always starts. You get it by Ume Flash, and then it, you just lose from there. Hey, oh, there I felt that flash kick. Nah, because he's gonna wake up grabbing if I block the flash kick. I know how this thing works. There, there, was, there was no me guessing right in that situation. No matter what happened, Daigo was gonna be right. Now with Tokido, I was surprised he picked Yurian. Yurian got worse from the last time he played. And it's like, I, I don't like this matchup for Yurian. I feel like Yurian really struggles versus Laura. <laughs> Especially now, because he doesn't have a headbutt. Because now I don't even have to second guess it. I mean, Yurian's but buttons are still good in neutral. The problem is, like, Yurian cannot stop Laura's Thunderclap for, like, anything. He's not great at it. So...
like it's kind of just him relying on like hitting like me like with like a million pokes and he still has to play at a cro close range it's not like Dalsim where like Dalsim's full screen away from me so he still has to play at a, like a really close range against me and then like if he messes up once I get in and then what you call it Yo, it's it's Urian, bro. It's it's Urian. It gets scary, bro. Laura versus Urian now, and you can't wake a mirror. Yeah, you can't wake a mirror anymore. You don't have EX headbutt. It starts getting scary when you're Urian. I don't I don't blame him for that. I could have killed, but I was scared to do the combo that I usually do, so I didn't kill. If I remember, yeah, nah, I, I was too scared to do the the actual optimal combo, so I just did like something I knew that would work. Like thanks, Link. Thanks, Zexel. Zello. I hope I didn't butcher your name. No. Yeah, I could have did like a neutral jump combo, but I was scared. That was like, what you call it? <laughs> Lucky jump. I know just like that. Look at him trying to escape desperately, and he's not gonna do it. His desperation. So one, I feel thanks for the sub, boon sauce. One thing I feel like people don't realize: if you do light kick command grab and somebody delay text, they're gonna get crush countered. I mean, not light kick command grab, light kick overhead. They're gonna get crush countered. I feel like a lot of delay text happen, and then you just got crushed. What about chasing the oh, jump wow. backs? Bad range, very rare. Oh. He backed off. He took a second. He knew exactly what was coming. Here it comes. No, it's a link. You know what's crazy? I didn't. Even, I actually didn't even realize that. That ain't combo. He took a second. He knew exactly what was coming. I dropped that. Here it comes. That did not combo. <laughs> That did not combo. <laughs> Was I happy to see Rashid in Grand and lose his finals? Yes. I like fighting Rashid. You know what's funny? I feel like I had a lot of good... This this was kind of my Evo to win because all the characters I played against, except for Guile and probably Dalsim, I like fighting against. I like fighting Urian, I like fighting Rashid, and I like fighting Colleen. So there wasn't really like a character that like I really didn't want to fight. After I beat Daigo. I mean, all of them panic. If you, if you don't know how to deal with Laura's V-Trigger, it, it's kind of scary. It is kind of... She's like one of those characters, and like, you, you gotta be ready. If you don't if you don't know how to deal with Laura's V-Trigger, you're just gonna stand there looking stupid. How do you deal with it? Asking for a friend. You just gotta stop the, stop the clap. Isn't necessarily one of the strongest characters in the game because she has to do all these reads. Yep. But if you're right all the time, then it's not a problem. That's such... Oh my god. <laughs> That's such a great example of what we're Stop the clown. About. He's putting different looks on all this time on that wet floor, I'll tell you that. <laughs> oh man. Oh boy. Yo, people don't know that's plus. That's plus two. You touch the button. One more mix up. Okay. Oh. Disengaging. Re-engaging all of a sudden and why, waking up with the jab? Why would you push a button? Why I don't would you, know. Why would you I don't know, James. Why would you? Because again, <laughs> how many times have we seen the cr crush cap? Okay, there we go. Bro, just V-shift. People think I. People think I'm capping. I don't understand. It's so Very good. Right There's there. no risk Again. behind it. So we've seen the cr what? What do you want me to do in that situation? Okay. okay. Very important right there because again. I have to do something silly to beat V-shift. There's no way to beat that. A good start to this round. But this is all just to get one win on the board right now. I, I take like a bomb. I take like a bomb. I thought you did a throw me. Yeah, keep oh, there yes, we go. Yes, okay, yes, okay. Yes, yes. And you should be able to build up enough meter for the critical okay. art here. There we Thanks go. Be honey With pro. A perfect gotcha coon on the board. Staving this off. He got it down to the final game against Kawano after going down 0 2. They're set and done. Okay. Oh, he woke up with standing medium uh -oh, punch. Uh oh, uh oh. He it's woke up one more sequence. Oh boy! Okay, stud. Not gonna quite have. He to might get no, super on this. He, he might get super. Need it. I don't even know if he needs it. He might get super. No. Oh, he doesn't even need the super. You know, I I I do think people don't talk about this. 
it sucks that all the international players have to come to other to the to the US, like all the Europeans and all the the like Asian players, they have to come all the way to the US and the US players barely go to like any tournaments outside of the US. I know like it's hard, but I really think we should go to like other countries. I think it'll help a lot of players get better. Yeah, I practice for sim. Yeah, I practice I practice a bit for sim. It's funny. Cause I practice for Sim, Luke, Guile, and Rashid. Those are the main four characters I practice him for a lot. No Colleen practice. I'm usually super good versus Colleen. I I feel like this is like one of my few instances where I actually lost to Colleen in tournament. I'm actually super good versus Colleen. He'll throw a thunderclap, and that is a common decision that he makes. And because a lot of players aren't ready to go throw out a big button after the throw tech. Nice use of EX Vanity Step right there to get the projectile in bowl. And here comes Kawano. And finally, Idom with the oh, oh. Oh, there's the crush right there. That didn't combo into the fireball, unfortunately. But here comes Idom. That fireball's still coming. He went low oh. 17 times in a row because he figured Kawano would be expecting the overhead. Big hit. The defense from this man, Kawano, unparalleled so far. What? Again, not using my own costume. They didn't have my costume on the setup. Calm down, calm down. The trigger. Here we go. Got the knockdown and he chases. He's looking for the V shift. There have been so few V shifts actually. Yes, there's one. Yo, look at that. That's not, that's not fair. Not fair. Yeah, Kawano's. Yeah, Kawano's uh, short. Can you kill in the situation? No. She's got the V trigger. I think she's smoked, dude. Yep. He just went for the overhead. Sure did. Dude. Sure did. Uh oh. He whiffed crouching strong and did a fierce afterwards. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Right. And here's chasing. Oh, no. okay. I should actually I should got punished for that, but V break. Bro, this mechanic is stupid. Oh yeah, because when you hit the fireball goes away. What? Just went through the thunderclap in that situation? I think he just threw a counter as well. Here's Idom. He didn't quite get that. I just dropped the combo. And to be my light kick again. Here's an opportunity now. Did I have it? Oh, and then he dropped the combo. Throw so much, so that if and tender foot. Can't punish the command throw, right? Absolutely. Again, the challenge. And maybe where Kawano's looking for V-Rev. Oh, Kawano never got hit by that. It, that that honestly impressed me. Kawano never got hit by this mix-up, like at Again. all. He blocked this every time. He blocked that. He blocked that side switch every time. And maybe where Kawano's looking for V-Rev, but boy, Idom has pressed jab there twice now. Okay, activation for Kawano now. And box reaction. Important place, but it, oh, back beautiful dash. defense. Oh, Kawano with the read. Oh, uh oh, back throw. Guess what? Activation not quite yet. Got oh, there it, it is. Activation. What are you gonna do? You gotta defend now. Gotta defend. There's the thunderclap. Yep, you catch. No, oh, the anti-air is ready to go. I'm surprised I didn't punish that. Challenge is nice, nice challenge right there. But here comes the buttons. Get punished! Wow, Kawano stun. Plus frames. Yep. Here's more pressure. He does get punished. Wow, Kawano's there in time. He's got the corner. And remember, his own offense has been good. The back dash this time from Idom. Not enough to kill. Okay. Beautiful, beautiful right there. Kuano calling out potentially the command throw, but the V reversal from Idom so smart. Okay, anti air. Idom trying to find one of those miracle jump ins that he's gotten so many times. Yeah, his jump light kick is off and around Cielo for him. You know what else can be is just great. Activating that V trigger and just the terror that happens afterwards. And that's the hardest part if you're fighting Idom all this. Is it good enough right now? Oh, it's not like Dark Souls? Oh, I didn't know that. I thought it was one of those, like, kind of, you're going to die 50 million times kind of game. Because the reality is that he has a life lead right now. I must be thinking of something else. Spacing, and he generally has fantastic whiff punishing, and he didn't get it there. Oh, I'm thinking of Sekiro. Yeah, yeah. How does he get that crush so many times? Here you go. Activation. This is the terror. Okay. Oh, my God. What is happening here? Oh, he tried to hit a button. No, that fireball is still going. I know. Right. And he's got corner pressure. Activation yep. comes. Here we go. Pressure now. Okay. That's. Oh, here we go. 
How is he gonna follow this up here? It's enough to stun! We're gonna be alive. This is the Reinhardt match analysis. Yo, if somebody puts it in here, I'll go over it. Getting a lot of momentum. If Kuano can stay this off and start getting and get himself on the board. Just needs one hit for the stun and it'll be over. This was very dumb on my part. This was actually very oh, stupid. Oh. But I will tell you this. I was not expecting to get stunned from that. That was very stupid. I should have probably just normal through him. But I was not expecting to get stunned from that. Because that did an absurd amount of stun. I'm so, I mean, that was a, I guess that was a good job. Like I said, Probably the job there, though. You need to finish your plate. You have to finish the plate. Otherwise, here comes Idom. There's that thunderclap, which has been just causing so many problems to so many people. Okay, activation. Idom wants to keep. What? You got champion. He got hit by almost everything. This was bad, but I over I guess I overestimated Laura's damage. Yeah, I, that part, I guess I kind of just overestimated Laura's damage, because I actually thought he was going to die. <laughs> you got champion, you still hit a button! You got champion, you still hit a button! I, I, I don't know what I could have done there. The heavy plunge bolt is such a bad knockdown to get. I can't do anything about that, and Visha puts you out of perfect range to jump right over me. Perfect. You gotta schmix that wrong. You gotta schmix that wrong. To be the evil champion. He's stuck. That was a good jump. That, that was a good jump, I guess. But I should have probably just normal through. That was a that was a risky command, bro. And he's spending everything he's got for the damage right there. I backdash. There. Yeah. Oh. Okay, that round was a wash. So I got, yeah, this this game I got robbed twice. That round I just got washed. was able to combo off of that, and there we go, a bunch of lows catching Idom, trying to walk backwards. Look at this movement from Kuano, beautiful. But there's the anti-air, tries to chase down the V-Shift, gets the counter hit combo to the corner here. Trap, regular throw. Stealing the turn in on the dash. Back dashing, expecting the escape. Anything's gonna do it for Idom to again. I got robbed here. This is where. This, I think this is where the elbow went the wrong way. Overhead. Overhead again. Command throw. Bro, I'm going to put this in the slowest motion ever. How did that not crush counter? I knew he was going to wake up Jab. How did that not crush counter? I knew he was going to wake up, Jab. <laughs> I got robbed. So Kawano, not only is he free from stun, but he's got the corner. And he's got a chance to pressure. Where's he headed? Backdash from... Hindsight, I should have probably view reversal that fierce. Where's he headed? Yeah, in hindsight, I should have probably view reversal that heavy punch. Backdash from Idom. That was a bad jump. Yes, Kawano has been... And then calling the thing. Combo into the setup here. Gets a hit. Oh no! Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Where is she looking? <laughs> oh, no. Why was she looking that way? All I had to do was activate V Trigger, and you know that's guess for game, pretty much. I could have probably did something about that. That wasn't EX elbow, but yeah, the moment. Yeah, Shivs, that's actually mad funny. They definitely said they fixed that from happening. They said that would never happen, and literally that happened to me at Grand Final. They said that was one of the buffs. <laughs> that time I missed a buffer, and I should have probably just committed. But I said. Bad mechanic. Okay, again the V shift. Oh, oh my god. And party she does. Bro, why did that whiff? I didn't even I Sarah delayed party, it too. James. Okay, again the V shift. Oh, oh my god. And party she does. Why did that whiff?
That didn't even that didn't punish me. I teched and then I got crush countered. And then he dropped his combo too. He missed the confirm. She still has some B trigger left. The life almost even here with 38 left on the clock. Scheming towards the corner. Thunderclap yet again. That was bad because I kinda wasted my my V trigger and that was kind of my only way in. No, too far away. And then that point. The problem here was like I woke up jab. It was a bad wake up jab, but like I knew he was gonna activate V trigger. I couldn't really do anything. At this point, I was kind of like, I gotta make something happen.